Hey guys, it's Maisie and welcome back to another video on my little channel of mine. Um, so today's Boxing Day and I've been shopping all day. I left about 11 and it is now a few minutes past 7, like quarter past 7 or something. And I've not long got back, I got back about 10 to 7-ish. Um, I went to Birmingham and it was a mistake. I've come back broke and I've come back wanted to crawl into a hole honestly it was so busy it was literally rammed i've never seen anything like it like black friday sales a few years back when people were fighting over tvs that wasn't as bad as what i witnessed today like oh my god victoria's secret was the worst i honestly thought that i was going to come out of an injury it was violent i'm not even joking like it's absolutely rammed it was boiling hot in there people everywhere Thro clothes were being flung all over the place the queues were literally going round the shop. Like, every single queue that I was in today, I was in there for a solid, like, 10 to 20 minutes. It's ridiculous. So, apart from all that, I have brought a lot, a lot, a lot of good stuff in the sales. And they're very high-end stuff. And I'm very, very excited about them. And I'm so happy and pleased with them all. So, I suppose if you want to see what I've got, I suppose we get in to the video. First of all, I went into shoe. Um, which is spelt like this, I'll put it on the screen right now. Um, and I was like, oh, let me get some new shoes, because every year I always get some new shoes for Boxing Day, like my money, that's like a tradition of mine. So I walked in and I was like, literally everything was like near enough half price, and I was like, this is decent. So I brought some Vans, and they are absolutely gorgeous. I'll put a picture on the screen right now. The reason I've got to do that is because I tried them on and everything and I was like the six are too big so I'm going to get a five. So I asked for a five and they didn't have any in stock so what they've got to do, they had to order it online for me and then it will be delivered to my house in a few days, like three to five working days they said. So like that's why I haven't got them on me right this second. Um, they're absolutely gorgeous. They were 55 or 60 or something like that and I got them for £26 something. Or £27, I can't really remember. But I was like, I can't walk past these shoes and not buy them. Because not only is that a massive, massive bargain, but it's also a gorgeous shoe, which I now need in my life. Like, I need a red shoe. I need, I need a red van. I mean, I don't. But in my head, I do. So, you know, that's what I brought. And then I wandered across, across, the, across the way. And I went into Calvin Klein's. I absolutely love Calvin Klein's. Like, it's one of my favourite brands. So I went into there and I brought this bag and it is honestly gorgeous. It is baby pink, like baby dusk pink sort of thing. And it's got the little Calvin Klein badge on, which is like leather. And it has a little pocket on the inside as well. And it's so small and cute. And I was I picked it up and I immediately thought, summer bag right there. So I'm literally obsessed with it and the strap is so nice. And I'm going to wear this everywhere, spring, summer, like, this is my bag. And it's got a pocket in the front as well, so that's snazzy. And this was originally £55, but I got it for £27.50, like, sorry, what? That is the biggest bargain of my entire life. Then after that, I went to Victoria's Secrets. I love this shop so much. Honestly, I'm traumatised by that experience, and I hope that that never happens again, but... I bought some cute things, so it was it was worth it, right? So I brought one of the Glow Platinum Foil Sheet Masks and then two of the 24 karat gold ones because I was like, just how cute are these going to be? How cute. To be fair, I only bought these ones for myself because this one's I'm giving to little Archkins tomorrow when I see him, so that's going to be exciting. And I brought two long sleeve tops because I really, really, really wanted some long sleeve tops from Victoria's Secret, like always have. The first one I got was this. It's got the little cute dog on the front because obviously it's out of the pink section because pink is my favourite. So I got the little lace at the front and then on the back it just says pink 68 in the yellow and I love it so much. It's a long sleeve, it's everything I want. And this was originally £35 but I got it in the sale for 20 which I think is an absolute bargain. And I also got this cute little camo one which just says pink on. It's long sleeved and that's cute. And this was originally 35 and I got it for 20 as well. After that, I then went into Hollister. I've always wanted something from Hollister, like so bad. It's always been one of them shops that I've just always wanted to buy something from, but never seen 
a Hollister to get anything from and never be bothered to order on the website because the shipping and that is so expensive. I went in and made sure I brought something and I'm not even joking, the th everything in there was 40% off. <sighs> so I saw this jumper and I just went, I need it. I need that in my life. Like how cute is this jumper? It's just a normal average jumper and it has a little Hollister at the bottom and it's like a little v-neck and it's the most cutest thing ever it's cropped and it's just absolutely stunning like i'm so happy with this i'm gonna wear it so much and get so much use out of it like it's gorgeous and this was originally originally 29 pounds but because it was 40 percent off i only paid 17 pound 40 which is a bargain i personally think that that is a very good saving and i went into harper and lewis this is one of my favorite shops by far like it's just so like everything in there's vintage and some of the stuff they sell in there is second hand and i absolutely love that like i love thrift shopping so i bought this jumper so it's literally just maroon well or burgundy whatever color you want to say it is and it just says harper and lewis athletics on it and it's the most cutest thing ever it's got little rolled up sleeves and I love it. I honestly love it. It was originally £30, but I got it for £21 because it had a 30% discount on it, which I think is a very good price. I went in there originally to get a new Harrington because I have a Harrington as it is, but it's a black one and it's like absolutely massive. So over the course of 2019, I need to buy a new black Harrington, which fits me proper and better than my other one. And then I also really want a beige one. So I was so close to buying a beige one because it was in the sale as well, like 30% off. And I was like, this is it. This is what I need. Um, so I went to go get one and they only had smalls. No, they only had mediums and larges. And then I found a small and the small was too big for me. So I had to get an extra small and they didn't have any. So that was so sad and depressing. So I've got to go order that online at some point. So that's exciting. The shop that I actually went to was New Look. We all know that I love New Look. So I don't think it was anything unusual for me to go to New Look. I had a £30 gift voucher off my auntie and uncle this year for New Look. So that's what I spent it on. And then I also found another £10 gift voucher. Don't know where it's from, who it was from when I got it, but I found another £10 one, so I had £40 in vouchers for New Look, so I spent it and then also spent another £20, because my brain just doesn't, doesn't function. If you know me, you know that I'm like obsessed with dungarees. My entire life, I've always wanted to wear dungarees, I've always been obsessed with them, I've always envied people that wore dungarees, because I would never, ever, ever be able to fit into dungarees, because I was just like, too big so i could never get a size that fitted me properly and so after i lost all my weight i managed to fit into dungarees and now i literally just live in dungarees so i brought a black pair last year which were like mom style and they were really cute but they don't fit me anymore because i've lost a lot of weight since because they're a size 14 and i'm like a size 8 to 10 now so they really don't fit me at all and then obviously a few months back i brought skinny fit black denim um denim dungarees from H&M which I absolutely live in and so today I thought that I'd purchase another three pairs yes not one not two but three pairs of dungarees in the sale because they were all really cheap so I got two pairs from New Look and then another pair from Forever 21 so the ones that I got from New Look is normal average bl dark blue denim dungarees they've got a zip at the side which I absolutely love and they're just like normal normal dungarees really because i don't have a normal pair of dungarees like all my dungarees are black so to have a blue pair is so nice and these were originally 29.99 but i got them in the sale for 14 which is an absolute bargain and then as i was scrolling through the rails i saw these ones and i honestly nearly cried i'm not even joking we all know how much i love corduroy stuff so they're these corduroy denim dungarees They've got the buttons down the side. They're sort of they're sort of wide leg, but not at the same time. Like they're just everything. Like they're just so nice. And I'm so excited to wear them. It's ridiculous. So these were originally $34.99, but I got them in the sale for $16, which is also an absolute bargain. I also got a new teddy bear jacket. But this one's sort of cropped. And it's actually beautiful. This was £30 but it's worth it it wasn't in the sale it was just normal price but i saw it and i was like you know what? i'm gonna get it because i really want a black teddy bear coat like i have this one but this 
It, oh, okay, it goes with a lot of stuff, but for my aesthetic that I like, I like black. Like, a lot of things that I wear are black. Uh, so if I'm wearing a black outfit and want to wear a teddy bear coat, this doesn't really go with it. So I've always wanted a black one, and now I've got a black one, and I'm so, 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 so happy about it. Also, ventured into Forever 21 after I managed to find it after looking for about an hour. Honestly, tragic. So one of the first things that I brought was this new phone case and it says and it says internet famous and I absolutely love this just because everyone at school like always says I'm like oh my god internet famous like as a joke so the fact that I now have this on my phone case is just hilarious but I picked up these trousers they are absolutely gorgeous like they're just stretchy elasticated at the top and they are a flared leg and they're yellow and black checked and they're absolutely everything like i love them so much and they're high-waisted as well and these were 16 pounds they weren't in the sale but i just bought them anyway because they're beautiful so i love these and i cannot wait to wear them because they're going to look absolutely beautiful on and with that coat as well oh my god gorgeous and then i also brought these dungarees which i'm like actually in love with like they're so so cute like it's got no back to it and it's just like normal, it's sort of like it's material as well. And it's just got big buttons going down the side. And they are a wide leg. Like, I love wide leg stuff. Like, I just think it's so trendy and so cool and so vintage and so cute and retro. Like, I absolutely love them. And the colour is absolutely stunning. Like, I'm so excited to wear them. It's ridiculous. They were originally £28, but I only paid £10.50 for them because they were 30% off which was an absolute bargain absolute bargain now there this is when my life went downhill very quickly very rapidly so you know they have a new morphe store that they opened in birmingham i was crying because i was like oh my god morphe i can go into a morphe store so Maisie purchased i was like what am i going to do i'm going to try my hardest to get the james charles palette which he collaborated with Morphe with but of course it was sold out I'm not even joking I had to queue I had to queue to get into this store it was that busy I had to queue to get in there so I went in there looking for the palette it didn't it was sold out literally I'm not even joking every single person in that store went up to like one of the shop assistants and was like excuse me do you have the James Charles palette in stock and they were like no sorry it's out of stock and they were like what about online and they're like, no, sorry, it's out of stock there too. But we are having a restock Thursday. And everyone was like, well, I'm not here Thursday. So that's a bit of a letdown. It's Wednesday. Tomorrow is not good enough. You know what I'm saying. So that was a bit annoying. But, you know, whatever. We will strive past that. And we shall order it online at some time when, when the hype dies down. But James Charles is going to that store and meeting fans on the 26th of January. So I'm very, 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 very tempted to go and I'm persuading my parents to let me go and meet him because that'll be the best day of my life. So, as we can see, I still purchased from the shop. What, you might be thinking. Well, I do love Jacqueline Hill. I love her. She's amazing and she's a queen. So, I brought the Jacqueline Hill palette with Morphe. I have been wanting this palette ever since it came out. And the fact that I now have it makes me slightly emotional. So on the back it says, Creating this palette has truly been a dream come true for me. Morphe gave me full creative control and allowed me to customise my dream palette for everyone to enjoy. Every shade was customised by me and I really hope you guys love it as much as I do. I wanted a range of neutrals and pops of colours to accommodate all skin tones. I put my heart and soul into this palette and I hope my pickiness pays off. XO. Jacqueline. And it's the most cutest thing ever. If you've watched my What I Got For Christmas Day video, you'll see that my best mate Evie got me the Jacqueline Hill Ring, the alarm palette, because she has like mini bolts as well. Because she's an absolute queen. She's an absolute goddess. Now I have this one. It just makes me emotional. So emotional. Oh my god. Just look. The fact that that is in my hands is actually mind blowing. Oh, this palette is dedicated to all my loving subscribers. I'm crying. I'm crying. I'm not okay. Am I ever okay though? Absolutely not. So I paid £37 for that, which I thought was pretty good because that's the same price I was gonna, sort of going to pay for my James Charles one. So I was okay with that. I walked down the corner. Right, I walked around the corner and I was like, is that a Jeffree Star lip scrub? Right, I see. Surely not. Surely they're not selling him in this store. I'm not joking. I walked down an aisle. 
there was another section of Jeffree Star cosmetics and Jeffree Star is my absolute god of the internet. I love him so much. I, I love his makeup, I love his tutorials, I love him as a human being, like he makes me who I am this year. I'm not even joking, like he's influenced my 2018 so much, like him, Shane and Jojo Siwa have made my year what it has been. So I couldn't really walk past it and not get a palette or a lipstick or something. And I was like, I've already got two of the lipsticks. So I was like, do you know what? I should get a palette. So I was like, what palette do I get? Beauty Killer's there, but it doesn't look that appetizing. I'm not a fan. I looked at the other side. Cause, yeah, there was more, there was more. I looked at the other side and they had this palette. I wanted this palette since it came out, but I just couldn't be bothered to order it online and pay for shipping and everything like that killed me. And so I was like, I can't not buy it. And it didn't tell me the price. So I was like, mother, go ask the woman what, what the price is. And it was £45. And I think that £45 is actually really, really good. So I brought it and I'm like, actually, I nearly cried when I saw it. I just look how beautiful them colours are. They're absolutely stunning. Like them blues and them greens. Do I suit blue and green? No, it washes me out, but will I wear them? Yes. I'm just, I'm just, I just can't. I actually can't. Like, I, oh, it's too much for me to handle. To begin with, I walked out with this in my hand. And I saw this, and I was like, well, which one do I get? And I was like, you know what, I've got the money. I'll get both. I'm now skinned from it, but it was worth every penny. And I don't regret it. That's the end of this video. That is everything that I brought, which I really shouldn't have. But I did anyway. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I hope you've enjoyed it. Smash the thumbs up button if you did. Comment down below in any other things you want to see me do on this channel. Follow all my social media on screen right now. You can subscribe. You can watch my recent video. And I'll see you guys in my next video.